basics of hydraulics, how hydraulics makes light work of heavy lifting. Uh, we have a new student today, Mr. Jack Hydraulic. Uh, greetings, Jack. Welcome to our class, dude. Thanks. Professor, can you explain how hydraulic jacks work? With a name like yours, you should know. Well, I don't. Can you please explain it? Yeah, I'll share my screen. Hydraulics is the study of liquid flows in pipes and channels. A common application is hydraulic machinery, including hydraulic jacks, forklifts, tractors, and other construction equipment, braking systems, aircraft control systems, and power steering systems. In all these examples, pumps and pistons work together to provide a mechanical force advantage. Let's examine how these hydraulic systems work. We'll start with a simple hydraulic jack. Notice there's a small piston and a large piston. The yellow fluid is the hydraulic oil that fills the bottom. We can apply simple equations of hydrostatics. Since one and two are at the same elevation, P1 equal P2, but force F1 is P1A1, and force F2 is P2 times its area, A2. And since the pressures are equal, we get this ratio. F2 over F1 is the mechanical force advantage. And since A2 is much bigger than A1, force F2 is much bigger than F1. That's how a small force can lift a heavy object. But there's no free lunch. The small piston must move down much faster than that large piston moves up. Thus we need to pump the hydraulic fluid, either with a hand pump or a motorized pump, or some jacks use compressed air, and we call this pneumatics. Other hydraulic devices use the same principles. Hydraulic oil is pumped into a cylinder. A pressure force is exerted on a piston that moves the shaft. Hydraulic devices are used in various kinds of equipment. In summary, hydraulics is useful because of its mechanical force advantage. Hydraulic jacks can lift heavy objects with little effort. Hydraulic pistons can generate tremendous forces. The key is the simple expression, force equals pressure times area. When a liquid is used, we call it hydraulics. And when compressed air is used, we call it pneumatics. Hydraulic machinery is a great example of applied fluid mechanics. Thanks, Professor. That was a very uplifting presentation. <laughs> <laughs> There's no room in my class for humor. Sorry, sir. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos.